boy P Town's fine shit coming back another banger. And man, 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 this is a long, long overdue video. I got a couple long overdue videos. I'm gonna be slacking. <clears throat> I got midterms coming up, so that ain't no excuse, but now it is an excuse. But yeah, whatever. We don't we don't have to worry about that. But bro, I got these on the release date, and I'm just now bringing you a video. That's kind of sad. Like I literally got it the day of to record it, and I just been like pushing them off to the side. So, anyways, let's get into this. All right, so as you can see right here, we got the Kyrie Low 2 SBSP SpongeBob SquarePants. If you didn't already know, with the white and wolf gray size 10, suggested retail 110. All right, so as you can see, we got the Kyrie Low 2 Sandy Cheeks. Yes, the cheeks, because these are complete cheeks. Now I'm playing, but honestly, my truthful opinion, these are probably my least favorite out of the whole entire pack of all of them. And actually, I haven't really took a closer look, too close of a look at the Pineapple Houses ones, because those like just recently came out. Um, yeah, honestly, I didn't really look at them too much. But anyways, oh yeah, give me your initial reactions. What do you think about these shoes? Did you cop, and did you cop any of the shoes of the, off the collection? If you did, which one was your favorite? Yeah, what you think? Are these nice hoop shoes? Who's hooping them yet? Who's, uh, who's busts some cheeks in the sandy cheeks? Let me know. In the bottom of the shoe, we got this all gray groove type pattern with the Kyrie logo in the middle. Moving on to the midsole of the shoe, you can see we got the all gray with the red dot on each pair. And that's cause the dot on the boot, if you didn't already know. And also this little clear piece kind of towards the toe cap part is the little, uh, the lines that's for her on her arms. On the front of the shoe, you see we got Nike Zoom. Moving on to the base shoe, we got like this knitted white base all the way around. The only, okay, so this is the only downside that I really wasn't a big fan of is if it did not have this, I would love the shoe more. I, I like it way better if it didn't have this part, is this clear piece. To me, I just, I don't like this. May, I don't know if it's on all Kyries like this, but, or if it's just like the like the clear part, because that's like with her like helmet, whatever. I don't know that helmet, but like her, whatever thing she had on her head, because she had the flower on it, like, if it, I don't know if it's like that, but either way, I just don't like this clear piece. Like if I could take it out, like I feel like it would look way better. On the back of the shoe, you can see you got the acorn, which is a really nice touch. That's one of like my favorite parts about the shoe. Moving on to the tongue of the shoe. We got this white, like, it's a couple different materials. And one that stands out the most is the fur up on the top. Let me know what y'all think about the fur. Do y'all like that? Like, are y'all rocking with it? Let me know. On the top of the tongue, we got the Kyrie logo. And it's kind of like a, a little, it's a, it's a different type of font, but it looks pretty clean in the red. And we also got the white laces weaving through up the shoe. To the inside of the shoe, you can see we got like this brown gold type coloring. And also for the insole, we got the Sandy's face right there, which that is nice. That is probably one of my favorite parts, again, of the shoe. Inside the tongue, you can see on one of them, it says Texas, has a little state. It kind of has a hold it just has a hard time staying, showing the whole thing. Inside the tongue, it has Nickelodeon. I mean, let me know what you think about these collabs. Honestly, I think the SpongeBob collab was really dope that Kyrie did. I'm not the biggest fan of Kyrie and his shoes, but I mean, this collab was pretty dope. It's nice to see some something different than just basic colorways. Yeah, man, let me know what you think. Where do these rank in your order of the SpongeBob coat drops? And uh, did you cop? Yeah, let me, let me know. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get on this on fear review for y'all, and I'll catch you on the next one.